So hi hello everyone welcome to the channel so in this video I'm gonna show you how to clip a country layer and count the number of places uh, using a buffer tool in RGIS Pro so now let's get started so now in the table of content section you can able to visualize we have two different layer one of the layer here represents our populated places for which represents for each of the countries and similarly the second layer represents our country's boundary layer so we can able to visualize we have our country boundary layer here and now I'm gonna show you that how to count the number of places uh, for the particular country for example we're gonna select this particular country and we're gonna clip it out and after that we're gonna create a buffer of around uh, 200 kilometer buffer around this country and using that buffer we're gonna count the number of places within that within the country buffer so now let's get started so now we're going to navigate to this option called analysis so in that we're going to click this option called geoprocessing tools we're going to click this to uh, option called tools so now a window pop up saying uh, geoprocessing in that let me expand this so now let us select our first tool here i'm going to search as select so now i'm going to click the first result here the select analysis tool so now we are in number select tool here so now I want to select the polygon that makes up the country of uh, Australia here so now I'm going to drag my uh, country's layer into this uh, input feature here I'm going to place this so now here I'm going to enter the output feature class name as Australia here so now here I have entered as Australia and here we're going to add a new expression here So now in the field, uh, I'm gonna select as uh, name here. I'm gonna select name field. So let me select the name field here, and we're gonna add uh, is equal to, and we're gonna select the country call uh, country called Australia. So let me select Australia here, and after that, we're gonna click this option here. That is uh, verify the SQL expression is valid. We're gonna click this. So the exp uh, SQL expression is valid. Now we're going to run the tool, click this option called run. So now in the table of content section, you can able to visualize a layer called Australia. Now let me change the color to color of this particular layer. So we're going to change this color. So let me select a uh, yellow color here. And, uh, and I want to uh, buffer the Australia, that is Australia layer by 200 kilometer uh, that is i want to i want to buffer the australian polygon by 200 kilometers so for that we're going to navigate to this tool called buffer so now navigate to this option called tools here and in that we're going to uh, search by buffer now in the search bar i'm going to enter as buffer so once you did that we're going to search this we're going to enter so here we have our first result buffer analysis tool so this creates a buffer polygon around the input feature to a specified distance so I'm gonna click this tool so now uh, the input feature will be of uh, Australia and uh, the output feature class will be Australia buffer dot shape file and now here we're gonna enter our distance here I'm gonna enter the distance to be around uh, 300 kilometers 300 and the linear units we're gonna select us uh, it will be uh, kilometers so we're gonna create a buffer of 300 kilometers so once you did that we're gonna click this option here run let me click run so now we have our buffer here so let me zoom to this uh, this particular layer that is Australia buffer we're gonna right click and uh, we're gonna click this option called zoom to the layer And uh, now I will use this, this uh, 300 kilometer buffer around Australia to clip out any places uh, within uh, this particular buffer. And now uh, to do that, we're gonna I'm gonna back arrow here, click this back arrow, and uh, let me clear this. So now in the search uh, window, we're gonna enter as clip. And now click enter in the key in your keyboard to search. So here, click the first result called Clip Analysis Tool. Gonna click this tool here. 
So now I'm gonna input uh, in the input feature. We're gonna select our populated places, and now in the clip feature, we're gonna select our Australia buffer here, and the output feature class name will be populated place uh, clip dot shape file. So now we're gonna run this tool. We're gonna navigate to this option here and click run. And now we have our result here. That is our populated place clip. So so here I'm gonna change the color of this populated place uh, clip. So I'm gonna change the color here. Let me click red color. So now the last tool uh, I'm gonna use is our uh, it is uh, get count tool. So now we're gonna select our get count tool here. So I'm gonna click this back arrow, and now I'm gonna enter as uh, get count. So now here you can able to visualize the get count, the data management tool. So now let me select this tool here. So now in the input row, we're gonna enter, we're gonna select our populated places clip, and now we're gonna click this uh, option called run to count the number of places within this uh, 300 kilometer buffer of Australia. So now let me click this option called run. So we're gonna view the result. So, so here you can able to visualize. We're gonna I have clicked the view details here. In that, we're gonna click this option called message. So here the total is around 226 places. So within a 300 kilometer of uh, Australia, uh, we can see the number of places to be around uh, in, a, in and around Australia is around 226 places. So in this video, I have shown you how to clip a country layer and count the number of places using uh, a buffer tool in RGIS Pro. So thanks for watching and uh, please subscribe to our channel and give us a like.